you know, the, what, the, the, what I always um, do is I think you might have got one. I just, I control what I can control. I mean, it, if things are out of my control with Ron and Fred and decisions that they have to make, I just want them to do the best that they can do for them, their families, and, and be wise with their decisions. And that's exactly what I would say to Shocker fans. That there's a lot of decisions to be made, but we've all got to control what we can control. And hopefully all of us, uh, it, it works out for the best for all of us. And I, I don't know I don't know what to say other than that. Um, we're going to go back and we're going to rest a little bit and then we're going to get ready to, um, to have a good spring, go back to work. And, and that's that's my mindset. But right now I'm going to, I'm going to uh, enjoy this season. I'm going to I'm going to enjoy my family and friends that are here in Cleveland tonight and um, just celebrate a wonderful season. First of all, I, I haven't had that very often, uh, but with these guys, uh, I want I want what's best for them. You know, I, I want to see these guys be successful, uh, and and if, if if it means lottery pick, first round guaranteed money, right now, and Ron's already got his degree. We got to sit down and talk about it. What I love is the fact that his family has told me that the decision is going to be theirs and mine, and we're going to all talk about it and get as much information and, and make that happen. Now, now, Fred, we haven't had that conversation, but I hope that I would have some input to try to help him. We're going to get information. We're going to gather that for him as well, and then uh, have uh, you know, they have to make the decision on their own what's best for them. Uh, I, I, I can't tell you right now. I don't know what that – advisory panel is going to come back with in terms of uh, the information but ultimately they're very they're very bright they're, they're tremendous young people and whether they play a second in the NBA or not I would bet anything you want to bet and give you really good odds that they're going to be successful no matter what well it's a good problem to have it's a great problem to have great problem to have Kevin I mean you're exactly right. Great problem to have having NBA caliber guys that have to make a decision like that. And the worst thing that could happen is they decide not to go and they come back and play their senior year. If they're good enough and they can be drafted in the first round and get guaranteed millions of dollars, then they've got a decision to make. But either way, they're icons. They're icons in Wichita. They're icons in our program. Uh, I think Tekel's going to make some money overseas. I think Darius is going to make some money overseas. And those guys will be successful as well. That's what I love. We, we're, you know, we got some, we got some grown men that are uh, just tremendous people, and they're going to go out and be successful people in our community, wherever they, wherever they live. Doesn't have to be Wichita. I'm telling you, they're going to be successful. That's that's what college is all about.